Hey buddy. You alright? 366 You're looking forward to it? Yeah. Sun's shining now, isn't it? Hey? I can't believe that. How lucky. Okay. We were waiting to get out of the house. Absolutely pouring. How far are we running today? Only five miles. Let's do Not it. Far. Yeah, let's get going. <laughs> there are so many days. I do not want to do this, but I do. Mate, we're about a mile in. It's like you don't want it to end, right? <laughs> I don't want it to end, but you wouldn't believe how many days I don't want it to start. Yeah. <laughs> it's painful. Yeah. Some days are a lot harder than others. Uh, that's the, the discipline though, right? Yeah, and it's enjoying the journey, right? Yep. Your journey is coming to an end uh, and you almost don't want it to, but you're about to start a new journey. Exactly that, exactly that. This is going to remain for five days a week as of 2021 and i got some plans for the other two <laughs> good stuff right get back running okay, okay. see you later. He's just cycling ahead of me into the great park at Bishop's Gate. Wow, I don't normally run this route. This is normally my cycle route. Well, I can say it's running up Crimp Hill. It's an easy. Wow, got me out of breath, that did. It's pretty amazing to be here though. And to have the one and only James Ketchell filming me. James, you're a massive inspiration to me, buddy. You really are. And I know that over the next couple of years, we're gonna do some crazy shit together. And I love that. Yeah, so his name is Andy. Just go crazy. And I'm gonna get it on camera. James Clear, I just want to say thank you for writing Atomic Habits because it's one awesome book. I'm at 365 days running and I thank your book and having read your book that got me into this habit and kept me there. So a massive thank you James. running the last mile. James has just cycled off ahead of me. Feels kind of surreal thinking that this is not my last day but I've hit the goal and this was probably the biggest goal I ever set myself in my life so it feels kind of weird thinking that this is it. I did it and it makes me wonder now what's possible for the rest of my life. I know if I can do this, I can do pretty much anything. There's been days where I really don't want to come out and I really don't want to run or cycle, but I push through that every time, every single day, I push through that and I'm so glad I did. Well done mate, 365 yeah, days, boom. That's well, how you roll, well done. To Stephen, to Lance, boys, you've run this down here with me a few times. I want to make this little video as a dedication to us and all the runs we did throughout my year 
and to say thank you for your continued support over that period of time. You've both done amazing and you continue to do so. Let's keep this up in 2021, boys. So just making a little video for Stephen and Lance in our running group. Good man. <laughs> well, boy, we're almost there. Yeah. Less than a mile to go. Looking good. Just around the corner. Beth, this is for you to say a massive thank you for all your encouragement and help over the last year. You've been amazing. You truly have. You've been there when I finished my runs and my cycles to make sure I got coffee and breakfast. And you've also encouraged me along every single day. So thank you, I love you. I really do. Is he having fun? So Andy finishes his 365 challenge today. That's so cool. And we've got the banner, which we're gonna put across. I think he's, he's coming. Ah, here he is, here he is. Here he is. Yeah, okay, we can move for the car if we have to. We've got a banner set up. Andy is just coming. And the confusion is we're gonna let this car go. Come on, just this you can lift it up. <laughs> Yay! Well done! Yay. Woo! Yay. <laughs> well done! Oh, thank you, How do you feel? Good? Hey, Jay, brilliant, buddy. Brilliant. Yeah. <laughs> wow! I did it. So what? So, so what's next? What are we doing next year? Even five, bigger. Yeah, five, five days a week. Yeah. <laughs> five days. Every Ray, you day. starting your 365 challenge today? Yeah. For the next 365 days, I'm going to breathe every day. <laughs> <laughs> and drink some water. <laughs> 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 Woo! What a phenomenal effort, Andy. Very, very well done. Yeah. Thank you, everybody. Thank you, everyone, for coming. <laughs> Yeah. You say well done to Andy. Well done. Thank you. Hello, yeah. Baba. Yeah. <laughs> hello, Baba. Daddy didn't say hello, did he? Hello, gorgeous hello, girl. Baby. You are beautiful, <laughs> hey? Yay. How are you today? Oh, they love it, don't they, you little ones? All right. No, oh, really look at that little bubble. Yeah, I didn't want to I can't wait till she's that big. Okay, so you have finished your 365 day challenge today. Just tell everyone a little bit about it and how you feel. Yeah, okay, so uh, on the, when was it? It was the 16th of December, 2019. I sat and thought, I'm fat. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I was 33 I think probably pounds. a lot of people probably can uh, agree with that, yeah. I was 33 pound heavier than I am now, and I really wanted to A, lose weight, and B, stop drinking. So I just made the decision on that day to stop drinking, and two days later, uh, I was looking for inspiration. I was looking through YouTube, and I came across a guy called Hellegood, who'd run for 365 days. Uh, and it was his finished video, him crossing the line, and somebody just snapped in me, and I said, I'm gonna do that, that is my mission. Uh, and so on the 19th of December, I chose to run two days, sorry, two miles every day for 366 days, because it was the leap year in 2020. Uh, about a month into that journey, I damaged my leg, I, I pulled a muscle in my leg, uh, and there was no way I was stopping. That wasn't gonna stop me. I um, I decided to switch out the two mile run for a 13 mile bike ride and I continued to do that. So it took about a month for my leg to get better and then I slowly brought back in the, the running and I've just carried on. And that two mile run has turned into 22 miles a day on my racer or between five and seven mile run. Yeah. And here we are, we're at day 366. <laughs> There's been days when I really, really yeah. didn't want to go out. It's been freezing can you, cold. Can you remember the hardest day in the last year? Is there one moment where you're like, I thought I was going to lose it on that day? Yeah, it was yesterday. Really? And I can, I, <laughs> yesterday was the hardest day. I yeah. was down in Somerset, I climbed up Porlock Toll Road, and as I came out from the woods, the wind just whipped across the top. Yeah. I almost got blown off my bike, I got blown into the side of the road, <laughs> and the rain was coming sideways yeah, yeah. into my face. Uh, there's been a few days like that. Some, some of it's where the cold's got me as well. What, what, but yesterday was by far the worst. What would you say the main benefits have been that you've seen over the last year? Uh, one is like there's been a massive transformation in my shape, which I love. I love looking in the mirror now. I love what I look like. <laughs> uh, I failed to just say that I did. I started off at 20 push-ups a day at the beginning of that year, 
and then I increased that by five push-ups every 10 days and I now do 100 push-ups every day without failure and it's just part of my routine yeah so I think like my upper body has also taken shape as well as my lower body and I think the best thing it, not the best things physical I love what I see in the mirror but in my mind it's how I think you know my thought processes yeah. are clean and I know That's the only way to explain so it. so you introduced me to a book tell me about that book ah that was atomic habits by james clear yeah it's an absolutely brilliant book awesome. and i would say for anybody that wants to make change in their life but finds it difficult james really explains it well in that it's in tiny chunks make tiny changes just yeah. small changes and stick to them and they become incremental and you know i'm living proof of that you know i've just hit the biggest goal in my life and yeah, i think well done james's book is absolutely brilliant it's, it's worth every penny yeah. it's my bible so it's james clear atomic habits right james clear book. atomic habits yeah, yeah go buy it a copy is, it's, it's fantastic. fantastic all right good stuff well very well done andy what, what thank an incredible you james journey. you've been an inspiration to Looking me too forward buddy. to the next year yeah of fun yeah brilliant <laughs>